Welcome back to the Art of Crochet blog and we've got all these lovely colours uh, for this week's square which is square number 82 and um, the picture uh, says it's a bit like a narcissus or like uh, that's a kind of daffodil or it could look like a clementine cut in half with those pips so I haven't decided which one it is yet but um, we will consider this as we make progress. So this is the beginning where I've done my, um, how many chains was that? Six chains, six chain ring and then uh, three chains and 15 trebles. So there are 16 spokes to our wheel. Um, and now I'm going to join the yellow. Here it is, sunshine yellow. And we're going to do, this is where the pips come in. So we join to any of those um, spaces between the trebles. There we are. And um, I'm going to do just uh, one chain and then a half treble into that same space. There we are. I think that might be the pip. And then we're going to two chain. One, two. So then we're going to skip two stitches. So I think it doesn't mean these stitches at the top here. It means these posts. So you skip um, uh, two posts and then go into that next space there. And then another two chain and skip two posts. Oh, I've caught that one in there. There we are, keep going all the way around. So here's our um, vanilla joined in and I've done three chain and a three treble cluster and then there's a four chain space and then we do a four treble cluster in that next space. So uh, one, two, three, four and this is the petals of course for our uh, narcissus I think you have to call it because it's not strictly a daffodil if it's white but it's like a white daffodil you know those ones with the, um, the orange trumpet uh, so there you go so another four chain and then four treble cluster in each of those spaces so on the fourth round I've joined the turquoise yarn and done uh, four chain and a double treble and then two regular trebles and in the next group we're going to do four trebles so this is um, obviously where all the square shaping is happening um, and when you get to the corner there'll be um, more double trebles so that's in the next space so we're going to do um, two double tre oh, two trebles oh gosh it's confusing isn't it two trebles let's just do them bit by bit one two and then two double trebles oh there we are and then two chain and then into the next space we do reverse of that so two double treble and so on oh and maybe it's in the same space I think it's in the same space so scrap that two chain and then two double treble all into that four chain space it should be big enough shouldn't it to fit all that in but we will soon find out and then two treble Okay, so let's have a look. Yay, there we go. That makes sense. So um, there's going to be some more bits uh, to fit into that one for the bottom corner. So four treble and then another corner and four treble and so on. So work your way around. So uh, the next round is the lime green. And uh, so this is a bit of a colour sensation. We're going to join to any of these corners and um, we're doing a round of half trebles. So that's uh, a two chain to start off with. 
and then uh, one half treble in that corner. And then we're going to do uh, one in each stitch all the way along the side and it says 12. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's your first one, that little one there. And uh, away you go. Not complicated. Half trebles all the way around. When you get to this corner, you do your two half trebles and then two chain and another two half trebles and uh, then you set off down the road again and um, here I'm going to be able to work that bit of yarn in inside the stitches so the last round is uh, double crochet remembering we're using UK terminology and we start off with one chain and one in the corner and then 16 down the side and when you get to the next corner we're going to do um, one DC and um, I can't remember what it was one DC two chain one DC so one DC two chain and another DC uh, before setting off down the side again and it's difficult to see where the first chain is when you've got um, the bit where you joined on but in theory there should be one um, there I think I might go into there because that's where the hole is but then making sure to go into this one here as well so double crochets um, all the way down the side okay so I'm done and I'm gonna write my label so that I don't forget which one it is. 82. Done.